went good. You know, I started off a little slow. I think I was like fifth the first test. So, and then you know the second test went good, and I was right there. So I thought, you know, well, I'm gonna ride hard all day and see if I can get on the podium. And you know, it came down to the last test between me and Russell Bob, and we both actually tied on the last test, which was pretty crazy. We go 13 miles and, and down to the second we, we tie. So, I mean, it was a good day. I had fun, and the 250F was working really good, and just excited to get to Florida and get the GNCC started. So, I think so. You know, we made a plan to, to get a couple more, and, and uh, I haven't found a place, to be honest. I wrote it every condition I possibly can make at home, and I never found a disadvantage there. You know, it seems like being lighter and, uh, you know, uh, not so abrupt with 450 power, but still got good power, that I'm, over, I'm overriding it. You know, it seems like I'm pushing it to the level, you know, pushing it to the limit instead of it dragging me around. So, you know, it feels really light, it feels nimble. And like I said, I haven't found a place that I don't I don't think it doesn't um, it doesn't shine. So I think I'm gonna ride it for you know for the next couple and see how things go. But uh, I don't think I have a choice. I mean, once I made the switch, I think I was I was gonna stick to it. Anyway. He's tough. Uh, when we did that national hair scramble and he rode that 350, he rode it really well. And I'm not surprised he switched. So and it showed the day he he was pretty solid. So I think he's going to get better as the year goes on. And he commits to it. And, you know, I think Russell he had a good day. So all in all, I think the competition is going to be pretty tough this year. You have to be on your game every race. And, 